can anything be done for eye floaters? If you've ever noticed those tiny, shadowy shapes drifting across your field of vision, you're probably wondering if there's anything you can do about them. Let's take a closer look at what these floaters are and what options are available. Eye floaters are essentially tiny clumps of gel or cells inside the vitreous, the gel-like substance that fills the inside of your eye. As you age, the vitreous slowly shrinks and becomes more liquid, causing these microscopic fibers to clump together and cast shadows on the retina. These shadows are what you see as floaters. Most people experience floaters as they get older, especially those over 50. However, some people might notice them earlier, particularly if they are nearsighted or have had eye trauma or surgery. Understanding the causes. Before we talk about treatments, it's important to understand the causes. Floaters can be harmless, but in some cases, they can indicate more serious issues like a detached ref, a rip in the eye, or bleeding inside the eye. If you notice a sudden increase in floaters, especially accompanied by light flashes or loss of peripheral vision, you should see an eye doctor immediately. Treatment options. Now let's talk about what can be done. Most eye floaters don't require treatment, and over time, you might get used to them and notice them less. However, if they're really bothering you, there are a couple of treatment options. One option is a surgical procedure called vitrectomy. During this surgery, an ophthalmologist makes a small cut in your eye and removes some or all of the vitreous, including the floaters. The vitreous is then replaced with a liquid to help your eye maintain its shape. However, this surgery comes with risks like bleeding, cataracts, and a torn retina. Another option is laser treatment, known as vitriolysis. This procedure uses quick pulses of laser light to change the collagen in the floater into gas, making it smaller or completely removing it. This treatment usually takes 20 to 60 minutes and may require two or three sessions. The laser light is directed into your eye through a contact lens and you can go home afterwards. Laser treatment details. Laser vitriolysis is a more recent development and has become a popular choice because it's less invasive than surgery. The laser vaporizes the floaters into gas bubbles that are then absorbed into your bloodstream. This method is generally well tolerated, but there's a risk of damaging the retina if the laser is aimed incorrectly. When to consider treatment. While most floaters are harmless, if they're significantly affecting your vision or causing discomfort, it's worth discussing treatment options with your eye care specialist. They will conduct a complete eye exam, including eye dilation, to determine the cause of your floaters and recommend the best course of action. In summary, while many people learn to live with eye floaters, there are treatment options available if they become too bothersome. Whether it's through surgery or laser treatment, it's important to consult with an eye care professional to determine the best approach for your specific situation.